Hmm. Well, it's three o'clock in the morning. I've uh, done my walk about here. I finished my shift up pretty much. Uh, I'm done my shift for the evening. Uh, boss is here to take over. And baby's been uh, almost amazingly chilled out and relaxed and calm and just wonderful. Mm -hmm. So no puppies, no action, nothing going on right now. So it's 3 o'clock in the morning. Technically, I guess it's Tuesday morning in the wee hours. So hmm. we'll just keep monitoring the baby. Oh, boy. Okay, so here we are. I'm gonna get ready to crash out, I guess. But uh, anyway, I uh, just want to thank everyone for all their love and support and everything like that. Um, uh, here's the thing I should probably mention though. Uh, you know, if anyone's uh, anywhere on the Vancouver Island, anywhere, and you know, feel like uh, stopping by and having a visit, saying hi, and uh, visiting baby and uh, giving her some love. I think you all know where I live now. <laughs> if you don't, well, figure it out. <laughs> anyway, anyone that feels like popping by and saying hi or anything, visiting, you know, hey, dropping off some, some kind of gift or something or anything of any sort, uh, feel free. Uh, you know, my door is pretty much always open. I, the only time it's not is when I'm sleeping, uh, I guess. And, uh, I don't know. That's about it, I guess. Anyway, uh, feel free. And uh, I would love to meet some, uh, you know, other people, travelers of any sort, as well as any subscribers, you know, like it doesn't matter, subscriber or just traveler, it doesn't matter. I'd like to meet with some people. So if you want to stop by and say hi, uh, just be expected to get filmed and <laughs> go on my channel. So keep that in mind. Anyway, uh, Baby's all chilled out. I'm gonna lie down, try and have some some uh, uh, Z's, I guess, and uh, I'll just get up in the morning and see how things are going. If anything happens, though, I'll let you know right away. <laughs> Talk to you soon. Bye for now. If you go down to the woods today, you're in for a big surprise. If you go down to the woods today, you better go in disguise. Cause every bear that ever there was will gather there for certain because today's the day the teddy bears have their picnic. Hey baby, where's all your friends? Where's all your friends? Where's all your friends? <laughs> your friends are waiting for you. Hello. <laughs> okay, see you in a minute. Oh. Hola, como esta? Como esta? Que tal? Good morning, everyone. How's everyone doing? It's uh, now 9.30 in the morning at uh, uh, March 1st. <laughs> March 1st, uh, 9.30 in the morning. Tuesday, that's it. Tuesday and it was a really quiet night like last night no action <laughs> so it's all, we're all good anyway I'm pretty convinced that tomorrow's the day tomorrow's probably the day but she could drag this on till Thursday for all we know <laughs> but she's been right on for, uh, before so so tomorrow's probably the day we'll see what happens could be tonight I don't know anyway she's doing real good anyway uh, really uh, I don't know, bad thought <laughs> occurred to me last night. I don't know if it's bad, but uh, the thought occurred to me anyway. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm not uh, monetized right now, and, uh, um, you know, so nobody can really help me out in that way. But uh, here's my point. Um, I realized I have the mailing address out there for my P.O. box there. If people send me cards, letters, whatever they feel like. Um, and I also have the email address, baby and me, tiny house on wheels at gmail.com. Um, send me more, uh, information and stuff and contact. But anyway, I thought with the, uh, PO box out there, um, 
someone out there might uh, try and send me some a check in the mail or something. And uh, I thought of that and I thought, well, sending me a check in the mail, that's not a good idea. Don't send me a check in the mail. Please do not send me any checks in the mail. It's not a good idea. Anyway, um, what I've got uh, on my, I put it down in the descriptions down below my videos. Um, and uh, what I've got is, I've got an email account that you can actually uh, e-transfer e money into. Um, and the reason I'm using that one um, is because it was set up the last time she had puppies for a floating account, sort of an emergency account for any uh, any problems that came up with, vet, with the vet or anything, you know, medical conditions that could happen to baby or the puppies too, of course, but especially for baby for her, her continuous life. But this account just sits there and it's got... Um, a certain floating amount of money for uh, in case you know something really bad happens to her and I have to rush her to the vet and you know it's gonna cost a lot of money at least I can throw down as much money as I can possibly throw at it to, to help save her life or whatever is necessary surgery or whatever um, you know and then at least if you know she doesn't make it at least financially I can say I you know I tried I tried everything I could so that was the account I set up for her initially and uh, that's the account i'm using so if you do want to send me anything at all any funds to help baby and the puppies and anything at all um yeah use that uh email account the email for e-transfers that i've got set up there you'll see it in the description use that only and do not send checks out never send checks out it's not a good idea anyway i just thought of that last night i thought someone might try that but uh um i thought i'd just uh do this, go this way, it may make things a lot easier for everybody and less likely to lose anything in the mail, if you know what I mean. So, for uh, email money transfers to help fund baby and the puppies, um, there's the email account down there. Uh, it's self-explanatory. And uh, anyway, uh, over and above that, uh, uh, it's a beautiful, beautiful sunny day out there. So... Uh, we're not going to wander too far, but we're going to stretch our legs, obviously, and uh, go just wander about nearby. And uh, excuse me, hopefully we'll take you with us. Anyway, thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for all your love and support. Just thanks for everything. Um, it's been wonderful. It's and I'm growing faster all the time. It seems. Uh, so anyway, I'll uh, stop babbling again and uh, just let's get on with the day. Finish my coffee up and uh, have something to eat and get out of here. Anyway, thank you so much, everyone, for everything. Can't thank you enough. And uh, and uh, cheers and blessings. <laughs> Ta-ta for now. Alrighty, we cooked up some eggs this morning. And... Uh, Babies can baby can smell it. She's uh, waiting almost patiently for her breakfast here. She's gonna love it. I know it. She loves eggs. <laughs> Give baby some eggs. Nice healthy protein for the puppies, eh? All right. I got eggs here too. <laughs> ah. mm -hmm. I just love eggs, man. I could eat eggs every day, all day. <laughs> mm. You like the baby? Mm. You're welcome. Anyway, it's a gorgeous sunny day out there, man. It's gorgeous, sunny, warm. It all pretty much feels like the day before summer out there. I'm not kidding you. That's how beautiful and nice and warm it is out there. So, you know, we got to get her out and stretch her legs and have a dump and all that kind of stuff. And, uh, you know, go somewhere, not too far away, but we got to do that. So once we're finished eating and that, we'll uh, take off and... Uh, I don't know, see where we can go and uh, enjoy our little walkies and stuff. Right, baby? Yeah, you enjoy that, don't you? <laughs> All right, we'll talk to you soon. Bye for now.
Okay, I've just uh, ran into a friend of mine, Phil. He's a good friend. Uh, neighbor down the road at one time. How's it going, buddy? Good, buddy. How are you doing? Not too bad. I see you're supporting the uh, convoy. Yes, I am. Yeah. That's perfect, perfect, perfect. Yeah. So, uh, when's the next rally? I hear March 5th or something is the... Uh, Big one down in Ottawa, yeah, March 5th. Yeah. Yeah. There's one every weekend that goes from Campbell River up to Victoria okay. every Saturday morning. Okay, cool. Yeah. Dude, it's good to see you again. I haven't seen you in quite a while now. You too, brother. I like your face. <laughs> Thank you so much, man. Thank you so much. Hey, yeah. keep up the good fight, eh? You too, brother. Yeah, take care. Get free, Canada. Fuck. I mean, get free, Canada. <laughs> I like that. I'll stop by sometime. Okay. Okay. Take care, keep up the fight, man. Okay, we're gonna have a little bit of a walkies down here uh, by my uh, community garden down here. Have a stretch our legs, have a walkies, have a dump, <laughs> all the cool stuff. So we're going to do that. Then we're going to head up to the post office, check that out, see if there's any mail come in yet at all. Uh, not expecting a lot, but anyway, uh, her friends at the post office will get to see uh, the last day of her being chubby and pregnant. They'll get to see the before and after. So I'm sure they'll be really excited to see that. And then uh, see the see her when the puppies arrive. All right, she's got her ball. <laughs> okay, let's wander around and then we'll go to the post office. Ciao. Well, I'm hoping your friends are there and it's not too busy. Oh look! Oh look! There you go. Oh. Oh. This could be the last day. See her, oh, Preggy. Yeah. Yeah. I'm expecting her tomorrow. Oh my goodness. 62 days today? Do you know how? Uh, eight weeks exactly tomorrow. That's pretty exciting. Much three days, right on. Yeah, she's always eight weeks precisely. Wow. <laughs> anyway, I'll check my mail and I'll come back yeah. and grab her. Back home again, back home again. Baby's liking that because it's raining out now. <laughs> she doesn't like getting wet. <laughs> okay, let me get organized. Ciao. She likes to get herself buried sometimes in stuff, <laughs> clothing, whatever. But uh, especially when she's pregnant, <laughs> she likes to, I don't know, just uh, bury herself down inside a bunch of comfy stuff. <laughs> Uh, there she is. Where's your friends, baby? Where'd they go? <laughs> All right. We'll talk in a moment. Bye. Oh. Okay. Well, that was a cool day. <laughs> cool day. Yeah, it was excellent running into Phil again. Uh, I'll have to run down to his place uh, sometime soon and visit him. And I know he's going to be definitely interested in uh, seeing these puppies. Yeah, for sure. I guarantee that. So I'll have to let him know ex uh, exactly when that happens. <laughs> yep. And uh, I've got notes again. <laughs> and one of the ladies at the post office has predicted three puppies in total. Um, yeah, we're going to see, I guess. <laughs> I'm holding out for four puppies still, but uh, it'll be what it'll be. Que sera, sera, right? 
I just want mom and all the puppies to be healthy and hearty, and that's it, no matter how many or what, right? But uh, baby does seem a little less bulbous than the last litter, so who knows here. And uh, <laughs> she's coming up behind me here with, uh, oh, her little pig. <laughs> anyway, I thought you'd like to check out these two little uh, bears here. They're kind of cute little bears. <laughs> and uh, maybe later on I will uh, tell you the story about them. It's not a great story, but it's uh, cute. Anyway, we'll probably bring that up next uh, time here. Uh, uh, we're just going to, I don't know, relax for a bit. And then we're going to have supper and everything like that. I'm going to keep my eye on the baby. She's dropped her pig on the floor. <laughs> but uh, we're going to do that. And just thanks for hanging out. Uh, everybody hanging out and thanks for all your love and support and everything uh, uh, you say and do <laughs> I just can't thank you enough for every one of you same with baby you can't thank them either can you enough you can't thank them enough can you <laughs> anyway we'll talk to you soon here uh, as soon as anything happens uh, we'll let you know straight away tonight or tomorrow or whenever <laughs> ciao for now Well, there's something I meant to mention uh, on my last little speech there. Uh, so just in case uh, you didn't catch it fully, there's a uh, Freedom Convoy, convoy from Campbell River to Victoria every Saturday morning on Vancouver Island here. Um, and apparently, from what I can read, they leave Campbell River at 8 a.m., but I'm not 100% sure about that because it seems so far on Saturdays when they come by here at Dashwood, they're coming by at 8 o'clock here, so I'm thinking they might leave there at 7 a.m. or something. But um, I'm just going to watch for it at 7 a.m. so I don't miss anything, and hopefully you will too, uh, from Campbell River to uh, Victoria every Saturday uh, morning. So there's that. And then uh, and there's also the, uh, the Freedom Convoy to... Uh, the Parliament in uh, Ottawa on uh, March 5th apparently so let's watch for that one and uh, yeah so uh, so uh, that's just another update and uh, I know for sure we'll be back in a couple of hours tonight uh, I want to keep you fully updated step by step with baby's progress uh, she's having a little nap or something right now I'm not 100% sure <laughs> she could pop anytime <laughs> Anyway, so this is uh, 2.30, Tuesday afternoon, March 1st, and uh, we'll just keep you fully updated on uh, the puppy situation. So, thanks for hanging out and watching. We'll be back really, really soon here. Ciao for now.